We can cross over to France 24's James Vecina now, who was following today's game between Burkina Faso and Ethiopia. James, ending their final group game with a tie works out just fine for Burkina Faso, but it does mean the end of the road for Ethiopia. It works out just fine for them, but it was decisive. They absolutely needed that point today. They got it and they make it their way through uh, to the round of 16. Alison, uh, as we Alice, uh, we analyze this game, uh, I think that the uh, first man that we need to mention is with Raogo, uh, Burkina Faso's goalkeeper, because he really uh, saved them so many times uh, and, uh, and uh, d um, didn't allow uh, Ethiopia to go ahead uh, and push any further. Some stellar saves, uh, which was so important uh, for them as they managed to win out that 1-1 one, uh, one draw. Now, today meant the return of Bertrand Traoré, uh, who returns uh, from uh, have, after having uh, contracted COVID-19. Uh, he was in the game, he was there, uh, present, maybe not quite uh, such as precise as he can be, uh, but they did do the job. Uh, after, after they opened the score, though, uh, there was that uh, VAR check by the referee uh, that awarded Ethiopia with a penalty. Uh, Kabede slotting it in for his side to equal and then after that, as well, Ethiopia really pushed forwards because they were bottom and remain bottom of their group. They needed those three points to have any chance of trying to go forwards. Uh, but Burkina Faso stood still. They stood their ground and managed to hold it through throughout to the end of the game. Uh, so Burkina Faso finished second, as you mentioned there, just ahead of Cape Verde uh, after beating them uh, in their fixture together. They are on the same uh, number of points, but Cape Verde have that crucial uh, spot through to the round of 16. Ethiopia's uh, journey, however, ends here. The one-time champions uh, of the Africa Cup of Nations uh, bow out of the tournament at this point, last in the Group A. Uh, this after picking up their one and only point today in that draw.